Mo, oh, just just how difficult was that a game tonight? So close to getting something. Yeah, to be fair, it was similar like the first game a month ago. I think we gave them a tough uh, tough match. We fight, we run a lot, and yeah, they just had a bit of quality uh, in front of the goal, just a little bit more than than we had, and that's why they won the game. How frustrating was it that that couple of minutes? Because you came a toe end away from scoring down one, and then suddenly a little moment of quality, like you say, opens it up. Exactly, that's what we have to learn. We have to learn to have this little bit ruthless in the end of the of the of the boxes in our box and on the other box in front of goal. So we, this is a this is a first season. We have to learn from this, and because you see how close the games are, we gave them a really tough tough game as well. Do you feel like the way the season's gone and the way the team has been playing that, that you are getting closer and closer to the top teams in the league? Yeah, well, expect, expectation and dressing room are high. We always look forward and we will just keep going, fight, and every team who comes here, or, or if we go away, we will give them a tough go. How early on did you find out you were starting tonight? Yeah, I know this already a couple of days, so that's fine. How did, how did you, you find it tonight, getting, you, getting your chance out there? OK, it's like any other game. In the game. I'm very relaxed in this. If the team uh, needs me, I'm there, so it's not a big surprise. No, but it must, it must be great to, to get some minutes, finally, because you've been operating on the bench quite a lot, so to finally get a start must be a sign that Chris Wilder has got real faith in you. Yeah, exactly. I, I was involved in a couple of games now, so I'm just really relaxed if the team needs me. It's nothing big for me, so as long as Chris Wilder is happy, I will play for him, yeah. Uh, as a group, are you happy to get Liverpool and Manchester City out of the way now? You've given them good games in, in every single one. I know that the away game at Liverpool was a, was a tough one, you've come close, but now some games that you, you'd hope that you've got a, a greater chance of, of getting some wins. Yeah, to be fair, we, we don't look too much on our opponents. Any, any game we play home or away, we just play the game. So we, are, we will now concentrate on the Millwall game, I think it's next. After Crystal Palace, just game by game and uh, win as much as we can. What does it say about the, the sort of spirit of the team that you never stop, do you? In, in the end of the game, you're throwing John Egan forward, you're throwing extra strikers off the bench. You're always going for it, aren't you? Yeah, it's an unbelievable team. I'm really happy to be here, to be part of this. And uh, yeah, we are just um, looking forward, never back. So you see this also uh, substitution always. We try to score, even if we are down. So it's really, really, I enjoy to, to be here and we all are a really good team, I think. And do, you, and do you feel with with the qualities that, that you've got and the way you've played, particularly against the big teams, that you can see this out now and get a top 10, top 8, even better finish this year? Yeah, of course, you can see our results, but we don't want to speak too much. It's our first season. We will learn from our mistakes. That's the most important, and we just keep going. And I know, obviously, you're on, you're on loan till the end of the season. Is there any wish on your part, if you can get some more minutes here, that you might have a longer stay at Bramall Lane? Yeah, the team, the people who need to know what I want, they know. So... <laughs> We will see what will happen.